I'm going to show you how I strip the insulation off your electrical conductors. There's only two ways I do this. The fastest way is a tool um, like this. Automatic stripper for your conductors. You can have them at the home centers, but good ones are highly effective and they are fast. Yeah. Put it on there where you need to strip, and it takes off the insulation instantly. The other way I handle this, if my if this tool is not available to me, what I'll do is I'll take my wire cutters, just take, you just kind of hit the insulation and pull the insulation off. What you have to be careful not to do is ring the wire. That's when you take your wire cutters and you actually touch the wire and you put a ring around it where you, where you cut it. If you see a little ring there, what that will do is cause a restriction there because electricity travels on the outside of your wire. So it's very important that you just ring the insulation and pull the insulation off. You don't want to go too deep. And that's pretty much the two fastest methods that I use to take the insulation off your conductors. This is my far the fastest. It pops them right off. So, for the average guy, um, this is probably the best tool. Otherwise, I use the wire cutters to do it. So there you have it. Probably the best tool to handle this job is one of these. And they are uh, not cheap, but well worth the money if you do a lot of electrical work. And this tool, I just wanted to let you know, is it handles a bunch of different wire sizes. That very small wire, all the way up to a 10 gauge. So it does a bunch of different kinds, and it even new thermostat wire. I'm not sure what that smallest wire is with gauge, but you can see uh, how many different gauges it'll take the insulation off the conductors. 